All right, folks, this is a 2019 Player Sportsman 850 SP. I wanted to install a rocker switch panel because players doesn't have any, uh, they got shit. <laughs> so I looked on YouTube to see if anybody has done that, and uh, there was nothing. Looked in all the players forums, nothing. I even asked questions about it in the forums and people laughed at me and said you can't do that <laughs> fuck you let me tell you something you can do anything you fucking want i do what i want nigga <laughs> all right folks let's get down to it i had to cut a hole here Installed the rocker switch panel, this whole panel here, bought it off eBay. These switches here, they go down underneath a good two inches with the plugs by the time you get the wire plugged in. The plugs for the wire, you gotta, you gotta bend them over so because it's really tight under there. You got the air box uh, there. And um, once you get this installed, I've fastened it down on each corner. You run the wires for this whole rocker switch panel all the way back. To here, now. Uh, this, this here is for a, a solenoid. Just for the winch, that's all this is, is just a winch. It's a 3,500 pound winch. A lot of guys get to 2,500 pound. Nah, get to 35. When your tires are deep in mud and you really got to pull, you're going to wish you had a 3,500. Anyway, the rocket switch panel, all the wires come back into this bus board. Bus board I bought off eBay. Uh, this particular one, a lot of guys use it for boats. So I, uh, everything's, all the accessories go into the bus board. Accessories being the whole switch itself, this whole panel, and then individually each light. So um, this one here, I'll turn that on, is for the rocker lights. I got uh, four of them, one under each fender. This one here is the LED light bar. Turn that on. Here's another tip, guys. If you're going to get an LED bar and you got a uh, front bumper as a, another accessory, I highly recommend you put it here because you can. You actually got to aim it down a little bit. A lot of guys put a huge 24-inch light bar up on top here. Looks gay. Looks gay. Don't do it. And number two, you don't need a 24-incher, okay? That 8-inch is more than enough. <laughs> All right. I'll turn these off. I don't want to drain my battery too much. And that voltmeter, you can see the volts go back when I turn these off. It is correct. It is, you can scroll through here and get your voltmeters like right there, 12.6, 12.5. It's not 12.6 because it takes 0.1 of this drawn power. This here takes 0.1. I'll turn on the LED, 12.2. So that, that is correct with uh, what's up here. All right. So everything on that rocker switch panel, including the rocker switch panel, gets wired into here. You could just pick any port to plug into. Any one of these ports. Okay. Now this bus board is plumbed into, or not plumbed, wired into the battery. I think there's one or two wires, one to the positive and one to the negative, I think. I might just be just the one positive. 
can't really remember. But anyway, you'll figure it out once you get the wire in it if you take this route. Bus board wired to the battery. Bus board and all the accessories go to the panel. Easy peasy, folks. Easy peasy. Uh, I just repaired this wire here. I actually got a hink, heat shrink it yet. Because this rocker light is not working anymore. I don't know what's up with it, man. So I'm going, I'm redoing the wire. Got to get it fixed. So that's it, folks. That's how I wired a rocker switch panel. What's that bracket you're asking? For my roto pack. What I just did, uh, this is the kit, the mountain bracket you get with roto packs. Well, you gotta pay it separate. But yeah, I just bolted it on there. Maybe sturdy. There you have it. Got the ammo cans on. Looking pimp. Look at this pimp ass wheeler. I got another rotor pack so I can carry two. If I really go on a long, long, long trip. If you, if you do the two, you got to get the extender, which I do have a uh, extender. And another accessory for rotor packs is to get the key lock. Don't do it, folks. Key lock sucks. It's full of dirt, mud, and it's a bitch to get that key unlocked so that you can get access to your field. A little too tight. There we go. Pimp. 420 out, folks. Peace.